You've heard of biscuits and gravy, but what makes this special is that it's sweet potato biscuits with wild boar gravy. That is just amazing. I cannot wait for you to try this at home. Put the wild boar sausage straight into the hot skillet. I love that sound. That is meaning that you've done something right. Break up the sausage to little bitty pieces because you want it to get throughout your gravy. Pour in a little bit of flour. Just put it right on top. This is the easiest recipe ever to make such a great meal. I'm adding flour just so it'll get a little bit thick. As soon as your meat is coated, put in warm milk. The reason that I like to use warm milk is it won't curdle in the pan and it helps, it helps this not to get lumpy. My sausage is already a little bit spicy, but it never hurts to put a little bit more pepper. Doesn't need salt. I'm gonna wait until this gets a little bit thick and I'm finished with this dish. That's how easy it is. Okay, I'm gonna plate this up right now. I'm gonna get a biscuit. I've already cut the biscuit. I'm gonna open it. Hey, you know what, why not? I'm gonna do two of these biscuits. And then just spoon the sausage and gravy right over it. If you use venison or you use wild boar or whatever you've got sausage, it is so good, it is just to die for. I told you earlier I had some chicken fried deer steak. So I am going to plate this up. I'm gonna give you another idea of what to do with your sweet potato biscuits. Put a little bit of mustard onto the sweet potato biscuit. Got your deer steak. This is something to smile about.